The US gives a green light to cryptos. TikTok launches its own NFTs. And can professional crypto traders be outmatched by a hamster? These stories and more this week in crypto. Hi, I'm Jaden from Crypto Gems, and here's what's happened this week in crypto. The chairman of the US Federal Reserve, Jerome Powell, said that the United States has no intentions of banning cryptocurrencies, including Bitcoin. He still asserted that some digital assets, stablecoins in particular, have to be regulated. This fresh, more optimistic US approach had an immediate positive effect on the market at the end of the week. TikTok has announced that it is launching a new collection of NFTs called TikTok Top Moments that is inspired by its own top creators. TikTok NFTs will provide a way for creators to be recognized and rewarded for their content. Fans can own a selection of six culturally significant TikTok videos from celebrities and creators. The leading payment processing company, Visa, announced that it is working on a new blockchain initiative called Universal Payment Channel. The cross-chain interoperability hub will connect different DLT networks. Described as a universal adapter among blockchains, it will allow central banks, businesses, and consumers to seamlessly exchange value no matter the form of the currency. Coinbase is unveiling a new feature that will allow customers to deposit their paychecks into their accounts as cryptocurrency. U.S. users can choose what portions of their checks should be converted to digital assets and all deposits can be made either in USD or in a digital currency of the customer's choosing. In its latest step in cracking down on crypto, China has blocked access to major cryptocurrency-related websites including CoinGecko, CoinMarketCap, and TradingView this week. At the same time, Alibaba, the Chinese e-commerce giant, decided to forbid its merchants on the wholesale platform from selling cryptocurrency money equipment in response to last week's warning that China considers all cryptocurrency-related transactions illegal. Following China's decision, several digital trading exchanges around the world are taking steps to shut out Chinese customers. Huobi will end services for Chinese customers by the end of the year, and Binance will not accept any additional customers with Chinese phone numbers. Chinese crypto users are now flocking into decentralized exchanges like DYDX, where the daily trading volume has surpassed even Coinbase. El Salvador is testing volcano power for Bitcoin mining rigs. President Nayib Bokele has released a video showing several digital currency mining rigs being installed in a factory which is stationed in a forest near a volcano. The project aims to power Bitcoin mining processes using 100% renewable energy. A hamster known as Mr. Gox has become a prominent crypto trader on Twitch. Mr. Gox's channel features the rodent running on an intentional wheel which eventually lands on a specific crypto. He then runs through either a sell or a buy tunnel, which prompts his owner to engage in trades of the selected asset. And those are the latest news on crypto and I'll see you on the next one. If you've enjoyed this video, leave us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and click that notification bell. Or you can visit our website in CryptoGemsOfficial.com, the link is at the description below. So you don't miss a review, news update or the clearest information about Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies anywhere.